Peter and John were so bold. It was like they had superpowers. Their boldness was so big and their message was about Jesus was so powerful that the Bible says that over 5,000 men believed in Jesus that day. And that doesn't include the women and children who heard and also believed. I know Jesus today because someone boldly told me about him. It was a pastor's wife who led a Bible study where she introduced me to Jesus in a way that I came to know Jesus and not just know about him. I'm wondering who boldly told you about Jesus and who you might tell in return. Jesus' power made someone bold so that I could hear about Jesus. And Jesus' power can help you be bold too. Trust Jesus. So back to Peter and John. The angry leaders threatened them and ordered them not to talk about Jesus anymore. And then they let Peter and John go. The men went back to their Christian friends and told them what had happened. And you know what their friends did? You think they went into hiding and never mentioned the name of Jesus again, right? No way. Are you kidding me? They prayed together, asking God for courage. I know we all need courage when it comes to being bold in what we believe. Know that you are surrounded here by friends who want to encourage you and remind you that you need never face anything alone. Let's pray. Father God, grant me the courage and boldness to tell others who you are and what you've done in my life. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hey kids, thanks for listening. See you tomorrow and have a great night.